This leads to the whole question of, of tiling. Um, and when I sort of travel around, I like looking at for pavements and things. I mean, here, for example, is a Cairo pavement that, that, that I saw, um, where it, it, it's a tiling with, 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 uh, with pentagons. Now, it, it can actually be shown that you can't tile with regular pentagons, but you can with irregular ones, and, and so this is what I had by my feet. And then in Bangkok, there's one with squares and octagons and dumbbells. It. But the most fascinating one I ever came across was when I was... Uh, teaching in Colorado once, and I was just in my apartment, just an ordinary apartment on campus. And I happened to, look, and I was making breakfast. And I happened to look, and I had, the, I saw the most fantastic tessellation my, my, by my feet. It was the kitchen floor, it was this amazing thing which has squares and pentagons and hexagons and heptagons and octagons. And I thought this was a fantastic f thing. I hadn't, I'd never seen this before. And they aren't quite regular. You need to sort of squidge them a little just to make the angles work. But I think this is, this is an amazing one. So I thought, I thought you might, might, might be interested in, in, in seeing that.